Have you ever wondered about the influence of big financial institutions on the cryptocurrency market? A Reddit user recently raised an interesting question regarding the impact of BlackRock to one of Wall Street's largest asset managers on the approval of Bitcoin exchange traded funds ETFs by the United States Securities and Exchange Commission. The user pointed out that while the SEC has been revealing several Bitcoin ETF applications, none have been approved yet. However, there was a curious incident where BlackRock's iShares blockchain and tech ETF with the ticker symbol IBTC briefly appeared on the Depository Trust and Clearing Corporation website before being swiftly delisted. This listing on the DTCC, according to the user, suggests that BlackRock's ETF application is very close to being approved. The user expressed concern about the speed at which uh, BlackRock's application seems to be progressing, especially considering that it was submitted just six months ago. This raises suspicions that the approval may have been a done deal from the beginning. The Reddit critic went on to speculate about the possible reasons behind this accelerated process. They suggested that BlackRock may have significant influence over the SEC, potentially influencing their decision-making process. Another possibility is that insiders within the SEC may be providing information to BlackRock on how to navigate the approval process successfully. And uh, to emphasize BlackRock's role in the ETF market, uh, the user highlighted that the SEC has approved 575 ETF applications from the financial giant, only rejecting one. Uh, this further fuels the suspicion that BlackRock uh, may have an, an unfair advantage uh, when it comes to uh, getting their, their products approved. Uh, the big question remains, will the SEC approve the first Bitcoin ETF? The pressure from the market and policymakers is undoubtedly mounting, but the SEC is not obligated to approve BlackRock's product or any other in the market. The decision ultimately lies in the hands of the regulatory body. In October, BlackRock made amendments to their spot Bitcoin ETF application with the SEC. They acknowledged the stiff competition for approval and made necessary changes to increase their chances. It's clear that BlackRock is determined to enter the cryptocurrency market and capitalize on the growing demand for Bitcoin investment products. As one of the world's largest asset managers with over $10 trillion worth of assets under management, uh, BlackRock holds significant sway in the financial industry. Uh, their expertise uh, in managing money, uh, ETFs uh, uh, tailored for retail investors uh, through their iShares brand, further solidifies uh, their position as a major uh, player in the market. Uh, so will BlackRock's influence be enough to sway the SEC's decision? Only time will tell. The cryptocurrency community eagerly awaits the SEC's verdict on the first Bitcoin ETF. And now say, for a lighthearted note, uh, for a lighthearted note on the subject, uh, why did the cryptocurrency go to therapy? Because it had too many blockchain issues. With that said, uh, thanks for watching, and uh, until next time.